So can we tell Soldier Boy 2021's ain't had the biggest comeback? Big facts. Big facts. Oh, I think, Big facts. I think that's I think, I think that's undisputed, bro. Big like facts. I think that's undisputed. You know, shout out to my nigga Soldier. You know, he had a huge comeback. But really, dog, I killed these niggas, bro. Yeah. Killed these I ain't gonna niggas. Like, you snuck, you snuck. I didn't even realize that was you killed. in that bitch. I'm like, Come on. when that nigga, I didn't, I Come just, on. cause I just didn't, you know, it's like, you look Come so on. different, bro. I didn't even Come really on. just. And that was my real here. That one, I grew my yeah. shit out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, everything, bro, just everything from, you know, just, yo, don't put too much makeup on me. You know what I'm saying? Yo, add a few, add, you know what I'm saying? I wanted to look different. You know what I'm saying? People see, but why nigga look like that? Cause it's back in the 80s. I, you know what I'm saying? And I'm coming off of, Pretty boy Zane. Oh, Zane with, like you said, oh dog, he was a pretty. I wanted to change that whole image. Saki don't even smile. Yeah. You know, if you know Zane, that's like, I'm gonna laugh with you all day. I made sure my character, like, he's no games being played. Like, you gonna believe if Saki smile, he might finna shoot you or something. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I had to, but I had to give my character a backstory. Like, Zane tell us too much about him, but you just had to, I was like, I'm gonna make sure this, that my fans see a difference in Zane. Like, I don't want my fans to be able to look and be like, oh, that's Lil Zane. I want them to have to, like, right. look at that shit, like. And just watch it for what it is. That's, yeah. that's how I looked at it. So yeah. That's far. And if I, and, and, if, if, and if you could watch this shit and really forget I'm Lil Zane, then that just, that means it's working. And I think people forget that you Lil Zane when you watch that. You know what I mean? And the, and the, I'm seeing with me and Lamar just kind of let people know. That nigga is crazy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's crazy. You can't stop the brain. But that let people that let people know just as an actor too, because like in the acting world, when you got somebody like Lamar's character and Saki stood up to him, in in the acting world, that's like, oh wow, he held his own on screen with somebody like that. Yeah. So that opened up doors for me and other things, like, oh shit, like even though he might be small in stature on camera, camera he can maybe. He could pull it off. I believe that he wasn't scared of that nigga. Right. You get what I'm saying? So I think just, you know, it just opened up a lot of doors, showed me a lot of shit too, just, you know, being on this show, man. And um, you and know. You, and you're actually from Atlanta. Did you actually yeah. run into BMF as a child or did you ever And that's the craziest them? thing? I used to be, I was always a little younger than them, but I've been getting money for a long time. So I was right across from them popping bottles. I probably wasn't even supposed to be in the club, though. I was probably 16, 17. With ten bottles on the table, I, you got to witness it full. Like, but I used to see them niggas like, yo, them niggas got a hundred bottles, nigga. Hide these bottles. We ain't, we ain't doing shit. I used to be, I used to be, yo, in the club. We was them niggas till they walked in. Like till they walked in. When they walked in, I'm like, man, put them ten bottles away, bro. Them shit. Them niggas got a hundred. They sending us, but I'm like, thank you, Meech. Thank you. Put them bottles away, man. Like it got like that. So when you um when you come when you're able to see them in action. That's why I think I had the advantage. Like me and Meech had the advantage because that's his son. So he knew what it was like. And I seen him in the club. So I used to just imitate how I seen them niggas in the club. Like niggas on set would be like, how you think I should do this? I'm like, well, when I seen them in the club, them niggas coming through like this, nigga. Like they wasn't, you know what I mean? But they wasn't as rude as people thought they was. It was actually nice as hell. Come through, buy bottles for everybody, even the niggas, you know what I'm saying, in the club. Every, when, they, when Meech walked in, everybody got bottles in the club. He wasn't just buying bottles for his crew. He buying, yeah, how many bottles y'all got left? Oh, we got 30. I want all of them and send everybody. Damn. Bring 20 to us, 100 to us and send the rest. You know what I mean? So just when you're able to see that, you just put that into the acting. And so you, it's kind of like you said, it's just surreal because I was watching that shit and now I'm, I'm playing it. You know playing what I'm saying? Shit, yeah, yeah. Shout out real street stars, nigga. Move.